Hey guys, Bobby here, and today in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys some um, headquarters gameplay by Cheese Meat, and it's a dual commentary also. And with us here is the man himself, Cheese Meat. Hey guys, it's Cheese Meat. <laughs> okay, uh, so um, yeah, so Joe, you do pretty good in this game. Um, please tell me uh, um, your strategy. For this game. Well, um, it was uh, this video was uh, my other YouTube. They don't have any more. Uh, it was uploaded at the beginning, so I mean they were all pretty much news. They didn't know what they were doing, so I was just beasting it up, you know, just shitting on kids. And I was just my main strategy was just camping in corners because I just got the game myself, and I was just seeing how to get a good KD ratio on this game. So I was just camping, and I have an AK-74U for you with uh, dual attachments and C4 and. Um, I don't know what perks I have, I can't remember, but other than that, I'm just, you know, camping corners waiting for the noobs to jump down the fucking ladder. So, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah I saw those kids just jump down and got them, AUG and got them, yeah. Yeah. Uh, what level are you right here, you know? Uh, yeah, I think I was already was like once. So, yeah, Prestige 1 or some. Okay, Prestige well. 2, I think. Were you playing with a bunch of kids in your clan? Yeah, yeah, I was playing with uh, Blackjack 30,000, Rand Shots, and uh, S Raw Killer. Oh, yeah. But, uh, yeah. So, I mean, in the air. Well, um, what you doing right here? You just sitting here? Just yeah, just sitting here. I, probably someone wrote me a message, so I'm replying back to it. Uh, but I'll start playing in a second. Yeah, I call my name on strike. Already, wow. And, uh. Damn, you went first, Did You do it like. Kind of like what like procedure was that? Like, like six, seven? Six or seven, I don't know. Damn, you were pretty high. Oh yeah, I know that you were like the only person I know. Like, like you were like the highest prestige person that I knew in this game. I know that. Yeah, cause, like, well, if I you look around, like all the other other teammates and the enemies are like first or second prestige. Like that guy right there who just got the spy plane. Headquarters online. And, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. Headquarters if located. Okay, well, yeah, so, but uh, a lot of people. Uh, you went hard in this game, didn't you? Uh, yeah, I mean, at the beginning, I w at the beginning of the game, I wasn't that good at the game. But, like as you can see, I was camping corners and not rushing. Mm -hmm. And uh, but you know, after a while, I got hang of it, and then I started uh, clan battling with uh, a bunch of other people that were really good. So, I mean, I kind of took my time on getting better at the game. I kept fucking learning more and more. But I didn't do no combat training or any of that. That that shit for bums. Um, well, actually, um, I think the new combat training is pretty cool. Like, three three different types of combat training in the new what? Black Ops 2. On um, Black Ops 2? Yeah, it's like uh, there's three. It's like one is um, with, like the super noobs who um, do like, shit. Like you have to um, actually join a game with like actual other players instead of just playing by yourself and killing mm -hmm. like, the bots. You actually play with like other online. Or so it's kind of like, like it's kind of like boot camp on World at War. Sort of, yeah. And, well, anyone can play it. Right. Like, like, so, um, I know, well, actually, like, the highest level you can actually get in, like, the, those games in the box is uh, level 10, I think. That's, like, the highest level you can get. Oh, well, I heard in uh, Black Ops 2, they're going to be matching you up with your own skill level. Mm -hmm. And, like, I, I don't know that how that's going to go. Uh, I'm pretty cool, sure. Right um, I heard that on the player cards, you know how, like, in this game, you, you can, like, you can have your own title and emblem, mm -hmm. a sort of uh, customizable emblem. Well, there's going to be a few new changes also. There's, um, you know, obviously you're going to have your own custom emblem, really good your own custom background for the your player card. And you're also going to have your gamer score, I think, whatever. That's like, uh, you know, like how good you are. It's going to, like, you know, rank you. I'm not sure what the ranking is, like 1 to 100, something like that. But it's going to um, show up on your card how, um, like, what, like, category you are. Right. How good you are. So people can tell. Yeah, yeah. If people are good well, speaking of playing card, I heard there is like uh, 32 layers now for the emblem mm -hmm. that you can make. Uh, yeah. I thought that was pretty cool. I know. Like I, I always enjoyed making all these uh, emblems. And, like, you know, looking up on YouTube uh, how to make cool card logos and things like that. Or funny right. ones. Yeah. I, uh, I, I know your your brother did that a lot, and so did I. I just like sent, sat there for hours uh, yeah. doing that shit, which is pretty fun. Which uh, sort of made me disappointed about this Mount Warfare 3. This game is just so shit, you can't do anything with it. Right. Like, well, that's, I mean, that's Activision for you. Blow. But, uh, Treyarch's making this game, right? Uh, Black Ops yeah. 2? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so, I mean, they're always, they're always up par on their new shit they have to put out, and it's pretty much always good, so. 
Yeah, like I mean, even though, like, you know, did you like the COD points in Black Ops? Uh, I mean, I liked it, yeah, but, uh, it, it was, yeah, it was okay. I just didn't like, I didn't play Wii Remote that much. I, 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 I didn't, I didn't play that. But know, other I than that, I mean, I liked buying what I wanted to buy at the beginning of yeah. if I unlocked that gun. I didn't want to have to unlock it. I, I like that part because mm -hmm. say I wanted like extended mags and FAMAS, I, I like that. I would want to buy it right away. Well, I, I thought it was pretty told, cool. Yeah, well, I think I told you that um, people yeah. might not know that, you know. Like, the prestiging is totally different in this game. Like, if you prestige, it's not just a reset button, but like, you start like, you know, back to number one with all your challenges with that you catch the kit. Um, you get too much, but you can keep all your attacks. I don't think I'm back until the way. I don't think you can keep the weapons, I'm not sure about that. That you get to and it is part of the season to unlock the gun. Challenges and uh, yeah, also your challenges um, you don't expect. So it's pretty much like it's one giant machine for this level. Right. Like, like, you know, like, you know, like, yeah, I think there's a uh, like as you can see, like it goes like a higher level, but the first machine is like 50 level, 45 level, like, and then keeps advancing to more levels yeah, and stuff. I think so I'm not like, sure the exact numbers, but that's what I heard. I mean that. I mean that's pretty cool. I've also heard there's uh, gold guns back. Oh, really? I've, uh, oh, yeah, I'm not I'm not sure about that, but I, I've I've heard. I, I don't know that's so much about that. Yeah. Well, like even like even the like there's even going to be camos for like riot shields and stuff, which is crazy. yeah. I, I I heard that. I heard that from my friend that uh there was going to be uh, camos and riot shields, which I don't know. If yeah, there's a snow map, I just might buy like a snow camo and like hide or something. Yeah. There's like gonna be like sub challenges for challenges. Like once you unlock like I don't know, like a camo for a gun, there'll be like a few challenges for that camo or something like that. Like or you know, sort of like sub challenges where like get like ten headshots with the silencer attachment to be like like so many challenges, like thousands, literally thousands of challenges that the people say. Which is right. gonna be crazy. Well, you know, but like it's still gonna be throughout the whole entire game, it's still gonna be tough to get all the challenges which is probably be impossible. So. Oh, and just one more thing to point out on this video is uh, I'm, I'm camping pretty hard here, and uh, it, because, like I said before, I'm trying to get a good kid ratio, and the game just came out or whatever, and, uh, you know, I'm just camping trying to get a good kill streak or whatever, so, I, I mean, that's why I'm not getting that many kills right now, so uh, don't write any mean comments about it because I'm camping. Um, I'm sure you understand because you've done that too, so. Yeah. Um, but back on the Black Ops 2 subject, uh, what do you think about the guns that are in it? Like, what well, guns do you think look good? Um, I don't know. A few of them, uh, actually are even real guns, but they do look really cool. Now, um, I'm not, I, I, like, I haven't seen much video, like, of, of the Black Ops 2 guns. I a lot about it. So, uh, I'm not really sure about that. But hopefully it's not like Mount Warfare 3 where every single gun is like, Right, right. right. But, um, okay, so let's talk about, uh, Astro turning into Black Ops 2. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, well, on Black Ops 2, we are advancing Astro to Black Ops 2. We're not going to end it. Uh, I know how much of you haters would love to think that Astro is going to end, but me, Bobby, and Blackjack30000, which is also in the game in here, uh, is going to be running it. And, uh, we're never going to end it. I mean, this could be on PlayStation 4, and we would never end this because we're going to keep advertising it all over the place on YouTube, on PlayStation. So, I mean, it, it's going to go good on Black Ops 2. I have a lot of loyal members. The roster's on the page. Mm -hmm. And uh, I have, you know, big uh, big things for Esra on Black Ops 2. I think it's going to be a real good time. I think we're all going to have fun. Yep, and, and you know, because, you know, Esra likes doing, you, know, you, know, you guys like doing clan battles and stuff. It doesn't matter if we lose a clan battle or whatever. We'll still do stuff. Right, right, yeah. I mean, clan battles, I think, are going to be pretty, pretty cool in that game. Uh, I mean, the game hasn't came out yet, so, I mean, you never know. They could be bad, but I, mean, I have high hopes for it. I wish I wish uh, the game come out already because I want to play. I know, so. yeah. Um, did you uh, get the normal edition or the hard edition? I am got the normal edition, but I think I'm going to buy the hard edition. I think I'm going to pre-order that. Yeah, I think I pre-ordered it on Amazon, so it should come in the the mail like the day of or yeah, even before. Hopefully it comes in before. That'd be nice. But uh then yeah. I also pre-ordered it <clears throat> at Black Ops um not Black Ops, but at um at GameStop. You know for the sixty dollar one. So uh I'm probably just gonna cancel that once I once I get uh 
like a hard edition. Right. Like, unless the hard edition comes like two days late, I'm gonna go to GameStop and get the other one. Already paid for it, you know, prepaid. So um, like I'm not, I'm not gonna wait like a day. And have that one. Right. Like, oh, waiting for my package. Uh, but um, yeah, I'm not gonna net the care package. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Just coming out the store with a big care package in your arms or something. Oh, come with, like, you know, wake up and go into your front door with a damn care package. Like, care package. Think it's a bomb or something. You open it up and you like to play a helicopter and shit. But it was a drone. Alright, guys. Well, we're getting to the end of the video. So, uh, comment, uh, like, you know, share it to your friends. Go on Facebook, share it, whatever. But, alright. We'll see you later. Peace.